This morning we have an update on a story about love and loyalty shown by customers of a Southern California donut shop. About a year ago, we showed you how one of its owners became seriously ill and her neighbors in a little surf town spread the word on social media and it made all the difference. John Blackstone returned to Donut City to see how the sweetness of strangers paid off. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, what a Christmas present to see you back here. Oh, yeah. Stella Chan is back behind the counter at Donut City in Seal hey, Beach, California. Just want to say hello. You're oh, looking good. Oh, yeah. For nearly 30 years, Stella and her husband John have been a team selling sweet treats. Yeah, she brings smiles to everyone's faces, and, you know, and they're just, just super loving people. Last year, there was doubt Stella would even survive, let alone return to work after a debilitating brain aneurysm left her partially paralyzed and unable to speak. Now it's stronger, stronger. I, I can, can hit, hold a tray, <laughs> whole tray. I need to move. I, I don't want to stay home. But with his wife in a coma last year, John came to work each morning at 4 a.m. alone. Then some of their regulars offered to help. Morning, sir. How are you? Two dozen. We tried to offer him money to help with the medical expenses with Stella, and, and he just wouldn't accept you didn't want people to I just give you money? No, 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 no. John would not accept okay. a handout, so his customers decided to try a buyout. I'd like to get a dozen donuts. I have two dozen. Give me a four dozen. Turning to social media, they spread the word to show up early and buy all of the donuts, so John could close up early and spend more time with Stella. I'm getting five dozen donuts. Five dozen donuts? Five dozen, yeah. I'm going to um, take care of the staff today at my kid's elementary school. Donuts were selling like hotcakes. I'm from Minnesota and I heard about this. This is awesome. People from 50, 60, 70 miles, they came here not only to buy just one donut, but dozens. They didn't even want a donut, but they came here and helped. It wasn't just people from Seal Beach or close by? No, other state, other country. Did all of that support, has that helped you get better? I think That's so, yeah. true. Yeah. <laughs> How are you? You're looking fantastic. Yeah, better, you look yeah. better. better yeah. With Stella's return, business is back to a normal pace, but the confections now come with special affection. I feel grateful. They give me a hug. I'm so happy. And the hole in this donut shop has been filled with kindness. When you come in here and see Stella behind the counter, Donut City's complete? Yeah, a twinkle in my eyes, uh, a delicious uh, donut in my belly, and the day is good. <laughs> wow, Stella looks good. She I want to go there. Yeah. And those donuts look pretty good, too. We have it on good authority from producer Robin Singer that they are delicious. Yes. Tony, I wanted to lick the TV screen, <laughs> but I thought that would be please, not dignified. Please, please, please. I want to taste it. It's an FCC violation. <laughs> yeah. All right.